Weeks of hype finally came to a head today in Bristol as thousands gathered in town for the 239th installment of America's oldest continuous 4th of July celebration. It kicked off from the corner of Chestnut and Hope Streets at 1030 sharp this morning. Joe Cortez was there with native Rhode Islanders and eager patriots from across the country. Joe. The 4th of July is in full swing. Bristol, Rhode Island is home to the oldest continuous 4th of July celebration in the country. And whether you live here year to year or you're just visiting the iconic Bristol 4th of July parade did not disappoint. Thousands packed the streets early this morning for another year of the Bristol 4th of July parade. This is something I've been doing since I was younger, so it, it just gets better every year, really. It's the best thing anybody can ask for. Bristol is where you're supposed to be. The celebration has been going on for weeks with ceremonies, concerts, and much more ahead of the big day that's brought in people from all around the United States. It seems very historical, you know, and it uh, gives you that, you know, community feeling, you know what I mean? That's the thing that's nice about it. People come back. My, my two sons grew up in Maryland but every year they want to be here. Lots of people were getting up early to reserve a spot. Some might call it crazy. Well, at 6.30 this morning, my wife thought I was crazy. I said, there's people who've been here overnight. I said, I'm not crazy. <laughs> the parade full of everything, red, white, and blue. Kids with some of the biggest smiles you'll see, and of course, those who represent the United States of America from overseas. Everybody's kind of on the same page. Like, you know, nobody's like fighting. You know, we're all kind of just out here doing the same thing. A picture perfect day for the celebration of America's birthday and what Bristolians describe as the most wonderful time of the year. Bristol's such a special place this time of year and um, being able to see people just enjoy themselves is my favorite part. Just really special to see that people still uh, appreciate our country and things uh, that we're doing here, you know, despite whatever else is going on outside of, of what's happening here today in Bristol. Next year will hit 240 years, and by that point, we're only a decade away from a quarter millennial. Reporting in Bristol, Joe Cortez, 12 News.